I made a real-life wonder flower, and this is how I made it. So I start off by finding some reference images online, and these are the ones I'm going to use. They're all um, <laughs> super high quality, as you can see. And then I threw these into Blender, and I made a model. A uh, slight problem, Blender ended up crashing and sort of kind of erased all my data. I mean, <laughs> I mean, can you believe it? I could. Print! Next, I'm making it out of plastic using my 3D printer. And it's only going to take around like, mm, like, like 50 hours to finish. That's all done, so time to start putting these together. See, that looks pretty good. That, that, that looks pretty good, right? And now I can just add the glue. Next, I need some materials, so we're gonna go on a quick little warmer run. Oh look, it's Walmart. Wow. Oh look, it's the Home Depot. Wow. Okay, I have secured the goods. As you can see, we have some little cracks here and that's actually no bueno. So we're just gonna add some wood filler to fix it. So it looks like uh, utter garbage right now and uh, I goddamn hate it. I mean, just look at how freaking bad it looks. I actually wanna kill myself. First, I'll cover everything with primer. Then I'll spray paint the base black, the stem green, and the petals blue. And finally, I'll use our acrylic paint for some of the finer details. I sanded it down so it's a lot smoother now and I should be able to add some primer. Fun little fact is that I got three hours of sleep and I currently have 10 late homework assignments. I might fail, but that's okay because I don't like school anyways. Now, time to paint it. This is the tape I'll be using. Since I'm using spray paint, I'll cover up all the parts I don't want to be blue. And then I can just grab the can and just... I'm still not done yet, and the tape didn't really work because the paint kind of leaked. It's a little messy, but uh, lucky for me, I don't get paid enough to fix the garbage, so... The last thing I need to do is clean this part up a bit, and then paint this part green. Anyways, it's looking pretty goddamn fantastic. The base is done, the petals are painted blue, but I still need to paint the eyes, so I'm gonna kill myself. The eyes are very small, so this time I'll be using some acrylic paint and paintbrushes. Way easier than using spray paint. I'll also paint these little star thingies blue. And with everything finally painted, I could assemble all the pieces. Weeks of intense labor had finally paid off. Oh my god! So, uh, I don't know if you can tell, but um, uh, it, it, it didn't exactly work. And this is actually why I hate my life, uh, because now I have to take this plastic thing off, replace it, and uh, oh yeah, suffer! Basically, I'll drill a hole into the base, then print out a plastic cylinder. And then, the piece can slide into the hole, the same way I slide my piece into your mom. It looks great! It looks fantastic! But how could we possibly make it any better? The final piece of my creation will be adding some LED lights. I will add these bad boys to the base, that way it can glow and look all cool and stuff. Once that's done, I can finally say I did something with my life. Look at how long this thing is. There's a bunch of different colors like blue, green, blue, green, and blue. It has this little sticky side on the back, so we're just gonna quickly peel that thing off and then we can attach it. But before I show you the final result, look at this thing. It's a mini wonder flower and I made five of them. I'm giving them away for free, the same way my dad left and gave away me for free. 
So if you want one, just comment your favorite power up from Super Mario Wonder and I'll pick five random people to win. So do it right now before I drive to your house and murder you. So this is the final product and in my opinion, it's pretty goddamn fantastic. And it only took me like, um, like one month of agonizing pain to make. It works great as a nightstand. It looks perfect on my shelf and even better on my desk. So overall, it's definitely something I'll add to my collection. So I made a wonder flower. Pretty cool, right? But in the end, it, uh, it, it sort of kind of all fell apart. What's important though is the journey. We learned how to 3D model, how to spray paint, how to farm. And what's the last thing? Oh yeah, how to fix this stupid computer that never works. <clears throat> oh, um, you're still here. If you like watching me suffer, you can check out my other videos or maybe leave a like or something. Uh, you can also like comment and subscribe, I guess. Please do it. I'm that 